guys, today we're going to talk about a collector and what you can do to protect your collection, or not to protect your collection, but to increase the chances of a stolen collection being recovered. What this person did was extremely smart and something that I didn't realize, but something that I can easily do as well and you can do as well. It will not protect you against um, somebody breaking into your car or into your home, but it will increase the odds that you get a collection that your collection that was stolen will re be recovered. So essentially, um, the original poster posted a collection that was stolen from his car, and someone from Castleton Game Preserve, big props on Game Preserve for realizing that this collection was stolen, and even bigger props on the original poster for doing what he did was. He made he put 75 treacherous pit dwellers in the front of his binder, and that triggered something with the game owner when they were like, "Wait a second, something is not correct," and that's very smart to do it because it marks your collection, right? It doesn't have to be pit dwellers. It could be nettle sentinels. It could be balliers. It could be altars, and we're going to talk about it. One of my binders. I actually put angelic destinies and there are different languages and not all foil some of them are foil and angelic destiny is a very good card and i like it a ton and i have uh, the binder is actually altered for angelic destiny the cover of the binder but the first page is all an angelic destinies and that kind of anyone locally houston would know that's my binder the other easier scenario in my opinion is just to commission an altar for i don't know 20 a simple altar and put it in your collection because in the front page that's a really smart way um, putting either lots of cards of a card that most people wouldn't see or putting a altar card where it would be so easy for you to identify for game stores you would just send them a picture of the altar and every and if they see a collection with it they can notify the police or you know if they see a collection with I would say a hundred nettle sentinels, right? Uh, in different languages, that's something that is not going to happen very often, and it's going to make your trade binder unique. So, if it is stolen, the game store, the game stores can keep an eye out for it. Very clever, in my opinion. I just wanted to share that with you.